Hey folks, welcome to the channel. I'm Don. This is Rockin' the Country. Still is. Has been for about six years. I am doing a gift request. Montauk Ed made a gift. So of course, I have to every so often trot this hat and this shirt because even though Ed's now in North Carolina for about three years or so, Ed, uh, he's from Montauk, as the screen name suggests. And I'm actually watching a uh, yeah, Netflix thing. I'm on season three toward the end of it of Royal Pains. And that's about a concierge doctor. It's set out in the Hamptons, which at Montauk Point is the eastern end of Long Island, which is where Ed used to be a commercial fisherman. He lived and all that stuff. So this reminds me of the sea. And I've been out there. I went out to, I spent time in Amagansett. And of course, you go into, um, you know, Montauk, you go downtown and yada, yada, yada. But my surrogate daughter bought me this hat couple of years ago before I even knew Montauk yet, but I have to trot it out. Gary Morris's The Love She Found in Me. I don't know this. It was a, a gift from Montauk Ed who said Jeff, meaning Jeff Cather, is going to be so proud of him, meaning Ed. So let's find out. I'm guessing this isn't a sad song because that's the repartee you two have going back and forth. And it's pretty funny to see. <laughs> I love this. And if you know anything about Ed, and all you need to know is he's a former commercial fisherman. He can take it. Whatever you dish out, Ed can take it. Well, I don't know this song. Have I done Gary Morris's songs before? I don't think so. She looked into a heart so sad Saw what no one ever had. That's good. Beneath the snow, she saw the spring. Nice. She finds good in everything. Give her thorns, and she'll find roses. Give her sand. Just see the love she found in me. She looks beneath each tear that's cried and somehow sees the sun inside. Even on the darkest night She knows where to find the light yeah. Give her thorns and she'll find the roses Give her sand and she'll find the sea Good. Give her rain and she'll find This was a nature song. The reference is in here. Sand, sea, rain, rainbow, snow, spring. Yeah, he's running with the nature themes. Yeah. When the world starts closing in, she gives me strength.
Billy Dean had a line in a song, Small Favors, I think is the name of that one. And Billy Dean's the reason I got into country music. The first song I heard that really turned me on to it was You Don't Count the Cost. But I went out, bought a CD, Small Favors, was a song on it. And he's like, she only sees the good in me. But with me, she has to look closer or deeper. And sometimes, yeah, y you do. Um, I understand the perspective in this song. Uh, there are upsides and downsides to it. When you see the good in things, it, you generally get along well with others. Um, but you can get burned, and, and you do at times. But that's just a choice. You could live as a curmudgeon and not get burned by people because you won't be close to that many people. If you open your heart up to people, then you're going to get burned by some where you've given a lot to and then they just torture you. Uh, they walk away. They just, they're not in it, whatever. I mean, anything can go wrong in a relationship, whether it's romantic, a friendship, a business relationship, anything. But in this, the way he's feeling that she sees what was underneath. She the beginning of the song, I think, said like she sees what nobody else saw. And that's validation. That's like, I really am a person. I am what you see. Yeah, I've been hurt, but she's going to love him, not necessarily out of it, but he sees it. He, he embraces it. And I, I think the love goes both ways here. Um, I forget how the line went. Yeah, the love she found in me, the title of it, that line is she's going to experience the love she found in him because it's there and it's sort of one of these virtuous cycle type things where he loves her even more because she sees him for who he is and still loves him but she's going to experience the love that he has it's just that's just a beautiful part of a relationship when you discover one another but I speak about this in my life coaching videos. I talk about it. I reference it once in a while in my music reactions, but certainly with people and in my various writings that believing in somebody is arguably the most powerful thing you can do for that person. Liking somebody is a wonderful thing. Loving them is big, but believing in a person requires seeing into them what's there, their strengths. You'll see their weaknesses too. But when you speak to their strengths, it's validating. Or when you even see their weaknesses, but laugh about them because you're like, whatever, we're all human. It's kind of easier to do when you get older. When you're younger, you dig in because you feel like you have to be like the fighter and, and represent yourself as all of that. Then you get older and you realize, you know, it's better off just being truthful about what your lane is or lanes are and what they're not. I'm very good at certain things and I'm not good at other things. And I'm comfortable either way. I don't misrepresent myself as being good at something that I suck at, for example. But when somebody loves you, they see you as you are and they still love you. They still believe in you. They still enjoy being with you. They still laugh with you and you with them. It's huge. And, of course, it's a Montauk Ed song, I just realized. <laughs> I got off and running every single time. I, I don't know if there's ever been a song that you've requested, Ed, that I haven't been. All right, now Jeff Cather's going to have his thoughts because you brought him into it. He was coming into it anyway. So let's see. All right, the number that popped into my head was a 9.1. It was almost like a torchy type song. And I don't know if Gary is exclusively country or if he, you know, crossed. This could have been a crossover even. But I don't know if it was a hit. But certainly the heart behind it was uh, the real deal. I appreciated it. So, Ed, tip of the hat. Tip of your hat to you. All right, guys. Have a great day. I'll see you on another video. And keep rocking the country. Mm -hmm.